This is how a human driver sees the road in front of the vehicle. And this is how the smart car's computer sees it. Software firm Civil Maps is developing algorithms that will turn this picture into something like this. To see the world around it, a smart car relies on a range of sensors, from cameras to so-called LIDARs, in effect radars operating with laser beams. All this helps the car position itself on the map. One of the most complex tasks for engineers is making sense of the huge amount of data collected each second by ADAS, or Advanced Driver Assistance System. Um, Shreven Pataganta is the CEO of Civil Maps. He maps spoke to VOA that. via Skype. Um, so what we specialize in is converting the raw sensor data coming out of the ADAS systems and converting that into meaningful uh, map information which can be shared amongst all the cars. At present, processing up to 10 gigabytes of information collected per one kilometer of road requires water-cooled graphic processing units. But Aganta says his company's mapping technology can run on the same processor used in iPhones and Android-based phones. It can actually anticipate uh, objects in the infrastructure and know where to look to find them. The benefit of this is you don't need to search 360 degrees to find a stop sign. Um, if you know where to expect it, you can just uh, focus your sensing in that direction. While being driven by humans, cars with driver assistance systems will also be observing how the driver reacts in certain situations, learning from their experience. So when it, the self-driving car encounters uh, that situation in the future, uh, we can study what you know millions of how millions of people reacted to that situation and um, pick the appropriate option. Cars coming off the assembly line within the next year may be equipped with the new technology. Ford is one of the first manufacturers expected to employ the software developed by Civil Maps. They may be followed by major car manufacturers from Japan and China. George Putich, VOA News, Washington.